An 18-year-old is dead after a police officer shot him this morning in northeast Austin. Police say the young man was naked and charged at the officer. The shooting happened in a neighborhood off of Jaeger Lane on Nature's Bend. Police say they were responding to calls about a man acting erratic and aggressive. KXA and Sophia Beausoleil is live from that scene with more. Sophia? Hi, good evening, Shannon. Investigators just left about 20 minutes ago. They spent seven hours collecting evidence and try to piece together what exactly led up to the deadly shooting. When we saw him, he had clothes on, and so I went and took a shower. Monika Holloway and her husband, Ernest, were working from home around 9.35 Monday morning. That's when the couple and others in their neighborhood noticed a lot of chatter on their subdivision's Facebook page. Well, I saw on the Facebook page, our residents' Facebook page, there's a lot of suspicious activity, like a young man running naked through the neighborhood. Police say people at an apartment complex behind Springs of Walnut Creek also reported seeing a suspicious man nearby. APD says when the officer arrived, he found a naked man in the middle of the street acting erratically. Giving him commands. The subject did not comply with the commands that this officer was giving and instead charged at the officer. Police say the officer responded by opening fire. When I heard two loud, loud noises in there, and I asked my wife, I'm like, "What is that?" I didn't and I was like, it. "I was like," and, she, and she's like, "I didn't hear anything." So I'm like, "Okay." So then, right after that, that's when we heard the slew of sirens that like were coming come. by. Austin police say part of what led up to the shooting was caught on dash cam video. And, but you can hear continued commands from the officers, and then ultimately you can hear shots being fired. They were doing CPR until they loaded him into the ambulance and took him away. Police say paramedics took the 18-year-old to a Round Rock hospital where he later died, yeah. leaving many neighbors with many questions. If he was naked, I just don't understand why shots were fired. I don't know where a gun could be or why a taser wasn't used. Austin police say at this time it doesn't appear that the officer used a taser at all in this incident. The officer that was involved in the shooting is on administrative duty, which is normal product, uh, rather normal protocol in a situation like this. They say he's been with the force for 10 and a half years. We asked APD a lot of questions, including was that man armed? APD says they aren't able to uh, give us that answer just yet. They're doing that in their investigation. As soon as we get anything, we will let you know. Reporting live from Northeast Austin, Sophia Beausoleil, KX. News. And we don't know yet if this suspect was intoxicated, impaired, or if he struggled with mental illness. An APD report released last year showed those are common factors in shootings connected to officers. In more than half of the incidents, 57%, the other people involved were on drugs, drunk, or mentally ill. The last time an Austin police officer killed a suspect was in July of last year. But then the department had to deal with three such incidents in just one week. First, officers engaged in a shootout at the Omni Hotel downtown that left a gunman, Michael Holt, dead. That same morning, three officers shot a suicidal man who pointed a gun at them in North Austin. And less than one week later, an officer fatally shot a 62-year-old man during a foot chase in southwest Austin. Police say patrol car video showed the man reached down to his waistband for a weapon prior to being shot. 